What's going on? Welcome back to the Jury Box. It's your girl, Empress Gem, Aries. What it do? How it been? Right? Welcome back to your March energy read, okay, for 2022. Get a video thumbs up, guys. Subscribe, comment, share, um, and all that other sweet jazz. But what I'm picking up for you guys is you've been hiding yourself for a long time. You've been hiding for a long time. And I feel like it's just probably been because there's been a lot of conflict, a lot of backstabbing. Um, I'm seeing a mazel tov. <laughs> um, just a lot of toxic energy around. What does that say? Free condoms. Ooh, geez. People trying to come at you with all the wrong energy. But I see y'all just trying to calm yourself down, feel me? Smoke your blunt, you know, whatever. Um, grow your plants. Admire the beauty and the nature around you. You've been sitting in solitude, though. And I feel like there's a lot of people around you who feel guilty. Or they're trying to guilt trip you. So that's why a lot of you guys also have been quiet and staying to yourself. Because people are trying to make you feel responsible for their downfall okay so let's get into the energy general message guys take what's for you leave us behind personals are so closed right so let's see divine holy spirit what do we have here for aries forgot how big this deck is for march 2022 i got big hands with long fingers <sighs> my piano skills are minimal to none I can play music. I can read it. So I probably could play the piano. I mean, but whatever. Anyway, back to you, Aries. <laughs> right? So, yeah, the Nine of Wands, resilience, Sagittarius, moon in Sagittarius energy in this card, but Sagittarius energy. Okay, like I said, rocking out, minding your business, meditating, listening to your music, saving up your money. I see you here with that piggy bank, right? Um, making shit happen. Y'all got a lot of shit in the bag. Like, a lot of shit in the bag. Like, on, um, yeah, you just, you ready to, like, if you, I feel like if you make music, you got mad tracks and shit lined up, and you ready to drop that shit, and that shit about to be hot fire. Kid you not. When you drop whatever this is that you've been saving up, building on, working on, whatever it is that you begin, you're going to display... Like I said, this is where the people might feel some kind of way because it's like, well, damn, you did this behind my back or what? I thought this was like a team and it was like, no, this was something for me. You know, like it's that type of energy here. But I feel that, you know, you're you standing up for yourself. OK, you standing up against the haters. You standing up against whatever's coming at you. OK, and I feel like this is physical bullshit, like people literally in your energy and your face, like 3D shit, like here in the now, like fucking with you. A lot of stress at work, a lot of stress at home, but you you're doing a damn thing, right? You, I'm seeing that she has this red around her throat. So I'm feeling like grounding the throat chakra. Like you're cautious of what you're saying. You're being mindful, okay? Because you you know what you want to entertain and what you don't. And like I said, you know, people are trying to guilt trip you, pull you into shit. And that's why a lot of you guys have been keeping to yourself a lot. Yeah, with the lovers. You took a look in the mirror. You are beautiful inside and out. You really don't give a fuck. Like you accept who you are, okay? You accept what you're going through, what you're doing, all right, Gemini energy, but you're making decisions for yourself, okay? I feel like a lot of you guys, I can hear she's coming in connection with herself, elevating and upgrading. Like she shut off whatever the hell she had on and she put on who she really wants to be, okay? And that's why I feel like you guys are going. You becoming who you want to be. And if not, that's what you need to be focused on for the month of March. Not worried about what the next person got to say because this is your battle. This is your fight. This is your journey, okay? You're going to accomplish. Yeah, listen to your heart. When it's calling for you. Yeah, a lot of people want to keep you in a lot of conflict, mental grief. And you already know this. That's why a lot of you, you know, you're keeping to yourself because you're just not trying to entertain it. You're looking forward to your birthday, celebrating with friends, not trying to fall in the lies of temptation. Could be done with a Capricorn here. Okay, yeah, you're just focused on your money. You, you're not trying to blow on stupid shit. You're being patient. You know, you're waiting for the sale. You know, you're waiting for that true date that you want to come through. You're waiting for that true idea or that true spark that is going to give you exactly what it is you desire right so let's see what do we have here for our aries aries you are yeah that material harvest reaping everything that you desire okay um 
you leveling up in all ways. And there's two nines. You're on your journey of self. You're focused on yourself right now. And like I said, a lot of you guys, you're getting ready for your birthday, okay? You're getting ready to become an, another year older, another year wiser, another year smarter, because that's two different things. And another year stronger, okay? Resilience, all right? The people around you, movement, choices, and decisions, two of pentacles. They watching the moves that you make. They're, I heard, I'm hearing seasons, like changing like the seasons. So you have people around you, wishy-washy ass energy, okay? And they only want to fuck with you when you're up, but not when you're down, okay? And I feel like now that you want to up and up in that material harvest energy, okay? Could be dealing with an earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, have you on a Virgo and the Capricorn here. But when you're up, they want to be around, but when you're down, they want to clown type energy, right? So I feel like now that you're just like, you're, you're, you've are you discerned who's for you and who's not. And that's why these people are coming around trying to guilt trip you. But don't feel bad. Like I said, probably in um the collective energy read, we all got the same 24 hours in a day, okay? What somebody else chooses to do with their time has nothing to do with you, right? If they want to waste their time watching you or having this pity party or wanting Aries to come in, you know, pick them up and fix them, that, they ask either, first off, they're going to be sitting around waiting. And secondly, that's a waste of their time because they could be doing better for themselves, right? Yeah, right now, I feel like you were patient in the past, okay, with that Sagittarius energy, 14 breaking down to a five, waiting for this change, planting a seed, watching it grow, nurturing it, okay, following your intuition, knowing the truth from within you, staying on fleek, okay, because her, her braids is fine, okay, like, she's on fleek, her skin look good, you've been drinking your water, taking care of you, working out, Um, you ready for that summertime flex, you get what I'm saying, like, you just been being patient, Sagittarius energy, I'm saying it again, so... But yeah, that's that's just where you're at in the past here. And I feel like you are coming out of this place of being, you know, patient and waiting and you're reaping what you have sown truly for your season to come. And that is the truth. You're moving into the truth. OK, judgment season. All right. Into your birthday, breaking down to a two into an alignment. OK, um, and to getting things together. We got two twos here. Twenty two. This is the year we're in, okay? You're you're getting yourself together. You're balancing the scales, and you're taking that leap out into the universe. You're, ah, I love, thank you. Yeah, discontent and boredom. You're no longer dealing with shit that's not serving you. Like, you're done with that. But real quick, in this material you harvest, the colors up here, this is what you are harvesting here. Everything you've been following your gut on, you've been speaking going, is coming to light, it's coming for you. You knew it was coming, okay? Your intuition told you it was coming. You knew it was coming. And this is the same colors up here, okay? And now you're walking through that door. You're walking through the door of abundance. You're showing, like, you're showing people, like, look, I fought hard for this and this is where it got me. And shit, if you would have fought hard too, that you'd be somewhere too. So let's get your advice. We're going to use a lessons card. Divine Holy Spirit, what do we have here for Aries for March 2022? Yeah, health. Health is wealth, baby. Okay. I will honor the physical vessel that enshrines my soul underneath. Again, that patience because you've been patient. You've been working on you. And now you're seeing the results of everything you've been doing. Right. So let's get your affirmation, Divine Holy Spirit for Aries. Thank you. Today, I feel optimistic. Today, I will see the beauty and goodness in the hearts of every person I interact with. And that's just it. Like I said, you see people for who they are. They flakiness, okay? You've met new people, people that, you know, you want to entertain, people who you see are really for you, who are elevating on the same plane, who have the same goals, same dreams, trying to reach the same heights, right? You've been speaking to these people. Like I said, you've also been grounding yourself out what your words and what you're saying as well. Like you're being mindful of what you say to people. You're not allowing people to put negative energy on you or make you feel any lower, than what you're not at all, okay? Again, and I'm seeing that patience energy here, okay? All these swirls of color, I'm seeing that patience energy here, okay? Just being patient, let, filling people out, letting people put their own foot in their fucking mouth, letting people doubt you so that you can step out by the end of the month with this truth, right? Right. So today, I am going in, bitch. Stop playing what I said. Summertime, fine. Getting that shit, yes. Today, I have huge amounts of energy and focus to take on any challenge. And it is clear as day. And everybody about to see it because you've been standing up for yourself, fighting a good fight, doing your work of it. Love to see it. So until the next time we talk, Aries, personals are still close. Peace out. <laughs>